Hi guys, welcome back to Nature for Kids, and today we will be showing you our trip to Antelope Island. Yep, we took a great uh, little family quick camping trip to do some bike riding, to play in the Salt Lake, and uh, just check it out. We've never been to Antelope Island before, so we thought we'd give it a shot. We also needed to test out our new uh, drone to get some footage, and there's not very many trees, if any, on Antelope Island, so yeah. we knew we wouldn't wreck it, although we almost did on some rocks, but it was fun. Just a little heads up on the drone, if you do try to fly drones at Antelope Island, you have to stay on one portion of the island and you have to get a permit first. It costs $25 to get the permit. So we got there, setting up camp. We immediately just uh, put the kids to work. How's it going, Corbin? Pretty good. Just chopping some wood for our fire tonight. Oh, look how pretty this is. It's so beautiful. Oh yeah, that was a good one. Ooh, you got three pieces out of that one. <laughs> Let's see if he can do it again. Oh, right in half again! Let's see what the dump looks like. Oh, there we go. Ooh. There's no pole. Everybody got a new sleeping pad from Christmas. All right, let's go outside. All right, what you doing? Working on being lazy. <laughs> He's building his hammock right now. I feel like a banana. <laughs> no, you look like a you look like a bug that's so snug. Okay, leave me alone, everyone. Okay. Oh, that's good, Axe. Just a little rough like that. Just keep that going. <laughs> so after we set up camp, we went. We decided to go bike riding at the Shoreline Trail. Oh, Corbin, tell us what happened. Halfway up, my tire popped. We just finished off the day by splashing around in the Great Salt Lake. Look down, it's brown! Guys, you are playing in the water. Turn around and look at the mountains right now. <laughs> well, we're in Utah, so you know this is warm. It is warm. It feels good, actually. Wait, I wonder how far it go. Uh, That's so cool. We're all the way out here, and it hasn't gone deeper yet. Like at we're all. all the way out. Ava, why didn't you drop? Do you think we could walk on the water all the way out to that that mountain over Probably there? Probably not. <laughs> out there, the Skipping rock. Ooh, let's see it. How many skips? I'm really bad at skipping. Oh! We found the, the sea creature of Salt Lake. <laughs> Ava's gonna see how far out she can go. I'm about to shrink. Hey, your pants are gonna get wet. Look, we're way off of the beach there, but we're still only 
mid shins here. Ah, Not the even the knees. We made another video where we went to the spiral jetty that's on the other side of the Great Salt Lake. So make sure to check that out. We'll have it in the icon above. An axe man should have wore shorts. It's okay. <laughs> We can change when we get back to the tent. I mean, we have like five more pairs of clothes. Oh, <laughs> you just couldn't handle not staying out of the water. Corbin found a whole bunch of these like little mud suckers. Don't. Little <laughs> these buggies. I don't know if they're like the smallest version of brine shrimp or what. Brine shrimp. <laughs> Comment below if you know what they are. Comment below. Wait, because wait. we don't. I made a shrimp hot springs. <laughs> Well, I found it. Look, here's a diving board. Whee! And here's a little Haspings mud. <laughs> That's for all the brine shrimp you find? Yeah. Oh, good. Yeah, 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 I got it, I found brine. it right there. A flamingo escaped from the zoo. Yeah, and, and it lived here. here for years and years. Yeah, and, and then it, it died. died. <laughs> Did you have fun, Abe? Yes, it was a thumbs up. We got some a good sunset here tonight. Yeah. Always playing some lacrosse. Beautiful. Now we have to hike all the way back to camp. All the way back. Heading back to camp. And they're playing hot lava. Can only stand on the rocks. I'm coming for you. <laughs> Who's on campfire duty? Crew is because Corbin's not very good at it. He keeps putting huge logs on a tiny fire. No, I'm helping. See, look, <laughs> that one That one caught on fire, just like I said. That's where we were, way down there. You can see some tiny specks of people. That's where we were. Beautiful sunset. All right, guys, night. Love ya. Night. Bye. Don't be very loud, okay? We got neighbors. See you in the morning. See you in the morning. Last night was not a very good night. We woke up like halfway through it, and our tent was just like flying around. Like, I, I swear it almost flew away. Um, and then, I wake up in the morning and my mom made hash browns and eggs and sausage and now life is good again, so good. Good morning, Ava. I didn't get any sleep at all because I was freaking out like you slept so much. No, I didn't. I woke up in the morning and you were like, uh, Oh, we have one more. <laughs> Crawling out. <laughs> Did you sleep good? Of course, you're the only one that could sleep through that. Yeah, he was like, <laughs> the wind was whipping. He was like, <laughs> oh, look at this messy mess. Their fault. <laughs> Their fault. Never you. After breakfast, we went and hiked to Buffalo Point. It was a fun, easy trail. Had some benches along the way that really helped these guys out. So we really only stayed on the north side of the island. We didn't even make it on the other side. Um, I, there's like a, an old ranch there uh, that you can you can pay for horseback riding. So there's and then there's tons of hiking and biking trails all over the island. There's good and bad wildlife on Antelope Island. The bad, biting insects. Yeah, biting flies. Kind of nasty all over there. Oh, bug bite. Oh glory, look at the bugs. That is a result 
of going out to Antelope Island. <laughs> Poor Nessie. The good. All of the buffalo. Yeah, there's like 550 buffalo on this Antelope Island. It's like yeah. one of the largest herds <laughs> in North America. It's kind of cool. Right outside Nessie's yeah. window, we got the heart of America. <laughs> So after our hike, we took off to uh, Heber, Utah. And the place that we were swimming at totally looked like a volcano. It was so cool. We're gonna try out our snorkeling gear for Costa Rica, make sure they all work and everything. Make and sure we work. Flippers. Make sure we work, yeah. <laughs> we need to try, try our flippers. All these. Try yeah. our flippers. And Going into the depths of the earth. <laughs> it's Indiana Jones. <laughs> Indiana Jones. All you need is a big boulder coming down this place and it'll be epic. The trick with here is you should show up in your swimming stuff because the, the changing stalls are kind of small and it's crowded. You only get one hour in the crater. Uh, you can go scuba diving there. We did some snorkeling just kind of floating around. It's pretty cool. But the time is limited, so uh, be ready to go because. Again, the changing stalls are kind of funky. Yeah. Just a big circle. First time using the snorkel gear. Outside of the hot tub. <laughs> This is just a little bit bigger hot tub. Yeah. <laughs> I'm coming. Axel's gonna give it a go. Right up here. You can see the bottom? Yeah. Awesome. <laughs> oh, this is cool. It's so weird to breathe underwater. <laughs> Water. Ah! It's the crater monster. Ah! How do you feel swimming inside a cave crater? What? <laughs> <laughs> this place was so much fun and it's warm all year round. So, yep. so you can go swim in there in the winter time, a little indoor, I don't know if you can call it indoor, in cave swimming pool. Yeah. Hot spring. <laughs> Yeah. Kind of cool. And also, um, there's like these steps that go up to the top, and there's a bridge that you can see through the bridge, and you can see the people swimming around in there. It's really cool. We're heading to the top of the of the crater. Here's what the outside looks like. We were down inside there. I can feel the steam right here. 
don't know if you can see him. That's where we were. <laughs> yeah. Lay in on a rope. What are you talking about? There's a hole right there. Careful with the camera. You talking about rappelling down into this thing? Yeah. No, we're talking about getting in for free. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for hanging out with us, you guys. Um, stay tuned because uh, we have a lot of adventures, including our family trip to Costa Rica. Woohoo! School is almost out, so we're almost there. I can't wait. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and let us know what's your favorite kind of quick getaway camping spot that you like to go that you're gonna hit this summer. Anyway, we'll see you later. Take it easy.